Well, the mystery continues. What is this black substance? Pretty big. That's a good size one there. A lot bigger than a than a usual size one. It's a shame they don't get bigger like a stone crab. It's basically exactly the same thing. Got them big claws on them and all. Pretty cool. Well, I want to thank everybody for watching the cicada video. Hope everybody enjoyed it. Thanks everybody that commented and guessed on what the pot actually came up as. <laughs> Here she comes, the cicada pot! Holy crap! <laughs> it actually caught some! Holy cow! Look at that, they're still in there! It ended up being the mix pot. Look at that, a nice big old fat Which, free bait, can't really beat that. Big monster crab! Like it was a paper shell. Oh, it turned shed so off the peeler, I guess. Had a real nice heavy crab in it and a peeler that shed out. It was a paper shell. I couldn't keep it. Had I checked it earlier, would have had a peeler too and a white bird. So it wasn't too bad. First up, we have hers with the Old Bay. Let's see what the boys think. That's one of the smallest mature females I ever caught right there. That's tiny. Little. It breaks somewhat easy. It's almost like gummy. We got jumbos for days, baby. Look at them crabs. Pretty crabs. They're all squeezy. Ain't bad. Nice pretty crab, Bill. Had the young bucks on the boat today, all the young guys today. They did a good job, worked hard, starting to get trained. They've been mixing it up here and there, depending on who's working and what's going on, their schedules and all. And I want to give them a shout out. They're doing a great job, really starting to get the hang of it, and couldn't be happier. For all the naysayers out there, the older generations, giving the young guys a hard time. Get to work! Look at these boys and see the future's bright. Training and working with them, that's going to be a good generation. Mm, God, it's got a nice vinegary smell. like oil or petroleum or something. I found probably 30, 40, 50 pieces of it. I've been trying to tag a few crabs here and there and get some of that going. I want to get some females tagged to see where they end up. Hopefully get some good reports from them. I had one report on a tag return. 77, the one with the white claw. He didn't go very far. Look, is he decent now? Good, nice, decent, nice and heavy crab, nice yeah. solid crab. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he's hardened up quick then. That's good because he was still a little squeezy when I let him go. So, good deal. There you go, the first return of the year. It's not real heavy either. It's some, it's pretty light. Somebody thought it was bilge oil. Somebody else thought it was graphite. I don't think, don't think it's graphite. It's like sticky in the middle almost. Other than that, a lot of just going through the motions, putting bait in them, checking them, trying to keep them clean. The hair, the slime, the growth, the foul, the sponge, 
a little crazy now. Water temperature's up. Next up, we have the greatest chip ever made, the Utz crab chip. Made with Chesapeake Bay crab seasoning, or better known as J.O. Come for two days, eat a couple saw crabs, didn't make a mess, took a couple saw crabs, ate them. I guess left a little mess, but no, didn't tear the tanks up, didn't chew them off and leave them in the tank, make a mess of everything, and it disappeared. It's gone. Never had that happen before. So I don't know. Hopefully it stays away and it's gone. Never know what he's saying. This one here has got like freckles on it. They're actually like like burns. There's holes in it, like where it's getting eat up. Weird. These have a lot of vinegar. These are almost like 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 vinegar chips. I would say these are pretty authentic with the corn crab go with the vinegar. Old Bay. We don't use Old Bay. These got crab cake recipe on there. Wow. I like the Utsus though. I think they're good. They're both good. You heard it here. With that's the evaluation. Yeah, we'll give you a shout out. Yeah. That's an awesome boat right there. Wanted to give a shout out to the to the to the fire guys, the fire boat, DNR officers, the tow boat guys, Coast Guard, all the guys that keep us safe. Happy Independence Day to you guys. Thank you for all you do. On the rough days, on the bad days, seems like when people break down, it ain't on the good days. So I appreciate you. Thank you for all you do. It allows me to do what I get to do. I know as much as you guys enjoy your job, I enjoy mine. That's a new one. Crazy clawed air on that female. Funky looking. Old nasty rotten crab. Happy Fourth of July! Happy Fourth of July! They're so happy to be calling your crabs right now in this 90 degree heat. Jellyfish and flies. Everybody wants crabs. Crabs seem like they fall off some. The man's crazy high. It is what it is. Hope everybody enjoys them. They ain't gonna be cheap. It's gonna be a good weekend. Weather's decent. And now, for the moment you've been waiting for, the great Crabber's fireworks display. Yeah, that's uh, that's about all the energy we got. Hope everybody has a safe 4th of July. And I'm going to bed. I'm tired.